Hey, I'm Josh with eatelkmeat.com. Uh, we're out here today hunting in snowy Arizona. Um, we were able to get our hands on a Baku Mule Hunter Elite package from eBike Generation, and we're gonna take it out for a spin. So we've had the Baku mule now for a few months. We took it out originally in September for our archery elk hunt in Colorado. Um, we had it up there for about three weeks and were able to put it through its paces. And now we have it out here in Arizona on a five day coos deer hunt. The mule sports a super responsive and easy to use left thumb throttle that'll get the bike moving at a moment's notice. Controlling the throttle power is simple and straightforward. Though powering your mule on throttle alone is fun and effortless, it'll burn through your battery much quicker than with just pedal assist alone. The mule's five built-in levels of pedal assist are controlled easily with the plus and negative buttons right next to the mule's display. Switching between these levels, one being minimum assistance from the motor and five being maximum assistance is incredibly easy. Whether using the throttle or the pedal assist, this thing is fast. We clocked this bike at nearly 30 miles per hour on level city streets and on the steep downhill dirt roads near our hunting area. The mule has no issue getting up steep inclines of our rugged hunting trails, but it ate through quite a bit of battery in the process. Depending on pedal assist settings, throttle usage, and the terrain we took it out on, we were consistently getting between 10 and 20 miles out of each charge in the backcountry, which is plenty for our needs. We pushed this bike through some pretty tricky terrain. From sharp rocks to mud and shale, the tires kicked butt, gripped the earth, and gave us no hassles. The fat treaded tires were the perfect solution no matter where we were hunting. Being able to get uphill in a hurry comes at a cost though. When Baku tells you that this bike gets over a 40 mile range, understand that this rating isn't for tearing up steep mountain trails and is more accurate under flat conditions with minimal pedal assist, like on city streets. We've had issues with spooking off game with ATVs and just the stench and noise that come along with them. Uh, we thought this would be a capable chariot to kind of get us into the hills. Um, we really like the powerful motor that it comes with along with like the sporty um, off-road design um, we thought that it could kind of take more of a beating than others in this class of bikes so yeah um, my first impressions are good uh, we like the power um, we're still kind of getting used to the gear changing and um, some of the issues there but uh, yeah so far my first impressions are positive Thanks for stopping by. This has been um, eatelkmeat.com's review of the Baku Mule. Uh, if you want to grab one of these for yourself, we recommend going to ebikegeneration.com. Uh, they have really good prices. And if you click the link in the description and use the coupon code eatelkmeat, you get 5% off, which is a pretty substantial discount on one of these pricey things. So um, overall, we're really happy with it, and we can't wait to take it on some more hunts. So thanks for stopping by.